Hello everyone, this is Jane Klein, Director of Client Strategy at CounselingWise, and I'm also in charge of the AdWords campaigns here. And I'm here to talk to you today about how you're, you should change your URL in the, your AdWords account. Um, if you have a new domain name, new www.yourtherapywebsitename.com, okay? This is what this video is about. So if you do have a new URL, you need to change it in your AdWords campaigns. So what you're going to do is you're going to log in and then you're going to click on this, which is your ad. So, um, you know, you don't want to be in, in your ad groups or settings or everything or keywords. You want to click on ads. and It's going to show you all of your ads. Now, for purposes of this uh, video, I'm going to go down to an ad that has very little traffic this one and I'm going to click on it because right now it says you know www.counselingwise.com well let's say we wanted to change it to uh, www.examplethepysite.com which we don't but for purposes so you're gonna get this and it'll say hey do you realize if you edit this you're gonna lose all of this is all gonna revert to zero right all of your um, you know the different numbers and, and, and click-through rates and all these measurements are going to go away, okay? But uh, this is the easiest way to do it. There is a harder way to do it where you maintain all of that, but that's more advanced. So this is the easy way. And you click, yes, I understand. And what you're going to do is you're going to go right here and you're going to type in your new URL. So it's, uh, you know, example therapy site, okay? That's one one place you need to do it, and then the next place you need to do it is you need to you need to go here because it may be that it lands on your home page, okay? In which case you just take this same one and go there. If it lands on your home page, okay, examplethepysite.com, right? But if you have new specialty pages, you are going to want to make sure that, that so it looks the display URL is is shorter than most um, specialty page URLs. So this is what Google this is what people see when they see your ads when they click on it where they actually land is right here. Okay, so if you have a specialty page, for example, right here SEO for therapists. Okay, that's what that th this this ad is. I'm going to want um, the URL from here. So I'm going to grab that and I'm going to go here and I'm going to say I want this specialty page, okay? So now it would be, you know, okay, so there you go. That's how you do it. Um, now, I'm going to go ahead and save this because this has zero clicks on it anyway. Um, and, and so that's that. Now you can see that this is different than everybody else's. Now, where you're going to run into problems here is there is something called a keyword quality score. And it's it's if you want to go and 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 Google all this and learn how to do it, um, there it's it's free to anybody. You're more than welcome to. However, if you Google's algorithm has changed such that if you're if you have a new specialty page and let's just say it's anxiety treatment and it you actually now land on your home page and the word anxiety treatment does not appear on your home page you will have a bad quality score for this ad and chances are Google will not show it so to make a long story short if you have a new website URL and you have the exact same ad groups, you know, exact same, right? These different ad groups. This one lands on the home page, SEO for therapists, AdWords for therapists. You can go in and do this. If, on the other hand, you have new specialty pages like anxiety treatment and you never had those before, you're going to need new ads. And I strongly recommend that you have 
either me or somebody else do them for you, or if you're very well versed in AdWords, do them yourself. But there's there's an art and a science to writing an ad, and it has to correspond with what the subject matter of the landing page is about, not the display URL. Remember, here's the difference. Not the display, okay? But if Google, if, if Google knows what's on this page, okay? If this, if SEO for therapists, if they click on this and you're actually selling uh, kegs of beer, for example, you, they won't show your ad, okay? and vice versa. It has to correspond. Correspond. It's very important. So if you're, if you have new specialty pages, you cannot simply change this. Okay? And I hope that that's all clear. All right? So I'm going to go ahead and pause this now because I don't want that ad to be... Um, <laughs> I'm going to undo this one when, when, when this is done. But thanks for watching. I hope that's clear. If it's not, please order a fine tune um, from me. And the way you do that is you go to um, what we do, and it's Google AdWords for Therapist. And you go here, and you order a fine tune, and you scroll down, and you click start now okay and I will do a very good job for you so if you're in the least bit confused please just order it if you have a very very simple straightforward web new website URL no new specialty pages go ahead and do it yourself okay thanks for watching